If you're looking for cheap, fast and reliable coins, then go check out the footfactory.com. Use code DAN5 for 5% off. They're just £3.50 per 100k. Hey, what's up guys? Dan here. Welcome to another episode of Ultimate Cheers. Now, before we even start, could you go check out Willingham HD? Links to his Twitter and YouTube are down below. He helped me a lot with this episode of Ultimate Cheers, providing me with like really expensive players like Legends, especially Crespo, Larson and Ibrahimovic, which I use for this trio. They cost 3.3 million coins altogether, and probably one of the like my favourite to use trios in this like whole thing. I mean, they're all really expensive. Ibrahimovic is one of my favourite strikers on a game. So could you hit the like button, get us to 100 likes, I appreciate that a lot. Now, um, we've got up top Jovetic, Vucinic and Soldado with 46 points, getting me 29 goals and 17 assists. And, and down in the last, we've got El Shirawi, Gomez and Quadrado with 33 points, getting me 23 goals and 10 assists. Now, this is a score which I used with this trio. We've got Vieira, Perez, Levetsi, Timothy and Bedamo, Umtiti, Thiago Silva, Mariano and finally in goal, Sirigu. Now, it's quite a nice attacking squad which I did enjoy using. It's a nice attacking squad which I won most of my games with. And uh, we start off with Crespo, who I do have to use as that cam position. He gets that link with Perez and also Levetsi with that Argentinian link. He's got 87 pace, 83 shooting and 84 heading. And he got me 5 goals and 1 assist in 10 games. Now, um, he's got the 5-star weak foot and the 4-star skill moves, but I definitely think he'd be better at that striker position. I mean, he's got a really nice finish from inside and outside the box, and his heading is just out of this world. Now, in the striker position, we've got Larson on the right-hand side, linking up with Perez and Crespo. He's 87 rated with that 84 pace, 82 shooting and 78 heading. He cost me 350,000 coins, he's one of the cheaper legends and he got me 8 goals and 4 assists in 10 games. Now the legends are dropping, no, they're going up in price, sorry. Uh, so I catch one up right now, if if you're going to buy one, you may as well buy them now because they are still going up in price. But now we've got Ibrahimovic, who did get me 15 goals and 8 assists in 10 games. Now, that's incredible for a striker and he's probably one of my favourite to use strikers as well. He's got the 4 star weak and the 5 star weak and the 5 star skill move, sorry, with a medium attacking and low defensive work rates. I mean, he was always on the ball. You can tell when it's Ibrahimovic on the goal, ball as well and he got me some incredible goals. Now, um, if you could hit the like button if you get us to 100 likes, I'd appreciate that a lot. I mean, I appreciate all your support on these videos. Uh, look at this, Ibrahimovic beating all the defenders and he was really unlucky not to get the goal but Larson finished off acrobatically. Now, um... Yeah, Ibrahimovic is really fun to use. He always gets on a ball, and you can use that like bit of skill move, just or like a scoop turn, just to beat the defender. And also, I mean, he's got such a good long shot. You'll see in some of the clips here. I just got some incredible goals with Ibrahimovic. I mean, that doesn't always happen with every player, but. Um, when you've got Ibra, you can literally finish quite a lot of the shots you get with him. Now, he picks a ball up here, beats the defender with, like, the fake shot backwards. And look at the swerve on that shot. The keeper didn't even move. He didn't even dive. I mean, look at it. You will see from this angle how much it actually swerved. It's just from outside the D. And look at this. Um, he takes a shot, and uh, it's going outside of the goal, and it spins back in and goes right into the top corner. Really nice shot from him. And probably one of my favourite goals I've ever scored with Ibrahimovic. Now, it's a right nice goal from him. And, um, yeah, so, like, we can move on to the next clip right here. Bedemo is in quite an attacking position, cuts inside, and feeds it to Crespo. And when you get a shot with Crespo, once he gets the time, he'll finish most of the shots that you get to him, um, like, 9 out of the 10. So, all these players you've got in a trio are really clinical players for any squad. And, um, like, you've got players like this, Crespo, sorry, to beat a defender and the keeper with ease. The composure just to be the keeper right there was just so good. Now, Ibrahimovic with the free kick right here, look at that for a powerful, accurate shot from him. I mean he can do that every game he wants I mean look at that just beats the keeper so well and um, he doesn't actually feel like he's got 75 or 76 pace whatever he's got in the card he feels like more like 83 84 he's just so quick on the ball but I guess that's because he pushes the defenders off he's got great strength he also got the skill moves just to beat defenders as well he can beat the defenders any way he wants he does a lot of acrobatic shots um, he, he supports the roles of Crespo and Larson and he just helps the team as a whole now look at this he runs off the opponent trying to get some space for him and he ends up bringing some space for Larson to get the shot away into the top corner it goes and a really nice finish from Larson again now he gets unlucky here again and it actually falls off to Crespo and look at this he gets a second of like space right there and it's taken a uh, time and he gets the shot away and it's a really nice finish into the bottom corner now Eber from inside the like uh, inside the box on the corner is always expected to finish a header like that I mean if you give any player on the game space like that inside the box you're expecting them to score and look at that for a nice finish from I think it was uh, 
uh, Larson actually. There's a nice goal from him. Now, Larson's quite quick. Once he bets the defender, there's not a lot of chance that the defender's actually going to like beat him for pace. I mean, it's a great finish from there. Messi-esque shot right there. A nice like sort of dummy and then a shot or a chip over the keeper. Now, this is what I mean by pace from Ibra. He gallops past the fence and a great finish past the keeper as well. Now, um, we're sort of at the mid-stage of this episode of Ultimate Trios. I mean, tell me what you think so far. We've got some great players in the squad. Look at that. Levetsi beating a lot of players and providing the cross into last one right there now if you're enjoying the squad and uh, trio episode of ultimate trios then could you hit the like button and get us to 100 likes i'd appreciate that a lot comment down below a set of trio like a uh Three players you want in a future episode of Ultimate Shows. I'm sorry, but this is a, like on a Monday not night, not like sort of normal time for an Ultimate Shows. But um, tell me what you thought of the World Cup. I always thought Germany would win it. I think I said them like in one of the episodes before that I thought that Germany would win a World Cup, and I was right. But um, it was a great World Cup. A lot of really nice goals, especially like uh, Tim K. Hills. You've got uh, James Rodriguez who had a great World Cup. Um, I don't know if he surprised a lot of people. He's always been great for Monaco. I haven't watch him a lot at Monaco but just watching him in that World Cup he was just brilliant he had so many times where he just showed you how brilliant he actually was and I haven't actually properly used him on FIFA so I might try him out in a future trio or a future squad builder so we've come up to the like the table sort of stage and we can show you how this trio actually did um, Ibrahimovic himself actually got me 23 points which was incredible and uh, this is how it looks we got them to third place 41 points with 28 goals and 13 assists so, uh, so it's quite a nice trio actually for the price anyway just behind that World Cup trio with 2 points behind and 5 points off the lead now so thank you for watching this episode of Ultimate Shows. I hope you have a very nice day. Show your support in the video. Uh, go check out Willaham HD. His links will be down below. And so thank you for watching. Have a very nice day. And see you later. And hope you enjoyed the video. See you later.